Hey YouTube, uh, so you're probably wondering why there are two episodes of Card City Nights 2 today instead of just the one that that was planned just last week in, in the schedule video. Um, so what happened is this weekend, I uh, before recording the second half of episode 7, I moved around my entire room, everything. Um, the room I record in, just all the furniture got switched around. Um, in the process of that, you know, everything got unhooked and rehooked up and everything. But I, I must have bumped the volume, the gain volume, uh, the gain knob on my um, audio interface, and I, I didn't remember, you know, where that's supposed to be. And I put it where I thought it was supposed to be. I I didn't do enough comprehensive testing of the setup before I just went right into recording you know, one and a half a couple episodes of Card City Nights 2 um, the audio came out really just terrible I mean it's not unlistenably garbage but it's it's back to a quality level from before I thought I was uh, at a quality level that was acceptable to start making videos and uploading them to YouTube so I apologize for that uh, here are the two garbage episodes uh, in one day, episode 7, episode 8, because um, I figured it'd be better to just uh, put the two out there, and then next week get back to some decent quality again, as opposed to, you know, stretching this out for, for two weeks, and and having, uh, you know, that, that big old gap of, of low quality audio. So hey, I hope you enjoy it anyway, and thanks for watching, and let's get right into it. Hey YouTube, welcome back, Card City Nights 2 here, uh, well, Gricket here, playing Card City Nights 2, I suppose. Uh, this is episode 8. Uh, we're going to do the tiebreaker against the groupie in the round robin tournament in the hospital in order to see who gets to see the superstar, uh, who I think is the A-tier gatekeeper, something like that, is where we are at in the story. Turnip Boy versus Groupie again. Um, oh, yeah, bump the mic. That's a good thing to do. Starting off strong again. He's probably like, oh, you cheater. You had that same thing last time. Last episode turned into a mess because I, uh, oh, I, I'm going first. <laughs> that's, that's why you have three cards. Yeah, last episode was a mess. This one's going to be amazing. Um, no, uh, I, I was in the middle of the last episode. It was kind of late at night and, uh, my girlfriend was coming home, wanted to grab some food. So I need to, st I needed to stop that one right away. And the game was telling me like, well, if you start what you're about to do, you're going to you know, strap yourself in. You're going to be here a while. And I'm like, well, dang, I don't have a while. So, uh, that's how that went. This, this AI always seems to know what I have in my hand. So I'm going to, I'm going to leave myself plenty of options. It probably doesn't like, I'm just being a dingus, but it really seems like it knows. I know there were, uh. I used to do some work on uh, the game Battle for West Noth, and we used to have people that were convinced the AI was getting different uh, random numbers. Like, it, it was cheating and getting better random numbers than human players. I don't want to sound like one of those people. really my only option though so let's do this it's active now at least oh and I can put an active fire sword off of that which will last longer which will let me use up this other one cool things are okay I mean I'm losing somehow but things are okay could really use some shieldage I mean, as long as they don't do me two on my turn, that would kill them, right? Let's play Gutsy. This is going to take me down to two and them down to one. And then as long as they don't deal me two on their turn, the Fire Sword will tick down. 
and we win. All right, gutsy paid off. Crud, I was so close. You, you were, you really were. Cricket, it looks like you win. You get to use the tracking station. Oh, right, I get to look at the end of the big green tube. Humbug. Finally, all I have to do now is beat Superstar and become A-tier. Oh, it's the B-tier gatekeeper. I can't challenge these people again, huh? Oh, hello, my name is Polite Student. It's nice to meet you. Did I talk to you before? I'm done with my studies for the night, so if you're interested in card battling or trading, I'll be right here. Ooh, what do you, what do you have? I have some cards up for trade. Let's take a look. Placement take one damage. There's all deal three, two damage. Yeah, no, no thanks. No thanks. No thanks on a lot of these, to be honest. Gain place, uh, resolve. Gain shield, deal two damage to the player with the most life. So worst case scenario, it does nothing. Interesting. I don't like these most life cards, because I'm not smart enough to use them. Uh, oh, right, I can go in here now. It's the superstar. Oh my goodness. Look at, look at her. Yes, I'm busy stargazing. The end of the green tube still hasn't come into view. I wouldn't want to miss it. So state your business and be on your way. I should challenge her immediately while I have the chance. A card battle. How did you know I was the A-tier gatekeeper? Never mind, please do not misunderstand, but I would not... I would rather not bother with the card game at the moment. The life of a superstar would be much too stressful without some alone time. Just between you and me, it feels like an eternity since someone had an honest conversation with me, let alone gave me an honest compliment. Some fans may think that hunting me down and asking for an autograph would make me wor more willing to give them one, but it's the opposite. Some people just don't value my privacy. Yeah, she, she's definitely the kind of person that says privacy instead of privacy. In other words, it's like you coming to find me just for a rank advancement battle. I am under no obligation to satisfy your request. I think you actually are under the terms of the, uh, the ship system. Although I suppose it is different. You can't have come this far without an interest in the card game itself. If you're here because of my skill as a card player rather than my social status, I'd be more than happy to agree to a battle. Try the Gunnel Vision. Give me some card sleeves. In case of blindness break glass, that's freaking hilarious. Apply eyes to this. Please stare here. Watch out. This is where you look. Check these things out. Okay, but I want card sleeves. Give me them. Give me fish bun freaking card sleeves. That's what I want. That's all that I want. Out of life. Alright, let's go. Remember, it's no good using anything but your very best deck. Turnip Boy versus Superstar. This is a weird stitched together thing. Alright, when active, whenever you would deal damage yourself, deal one damage instead. Okay, it's gonna be one of those kinds of games, huh? Full blast with the gimmicks. Bring it on. Silence one of your cards. Resolve deal three. Okay. Ah, oh, you jerk. Oh, we're building a big old combo here. Oh, they got a shield. That's alright, I'm dealing damage in like ticks of one, so. Dealt three. That hurt. Take three. Resolve deal three. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, here we go. I want another one of these shields. Oh, maybe I need the shield like right away. Oh, goodness. Maybe I need the shield like right away. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, let's do that.
Oh no. Wait, I win. It's okay. <laughs> oh god, that was spooky. Alright, let's try this again. Oh boy. I mean, presumably I'll draw something to attach to this, right? Presumably. As in, able to be presumed. Deal two, take three. I mean, I'm not gonna... Oh wait, I do want that to resolve. They take three when it resolves. Yeah, screw you, buddy. I'm turning that on. I don't care. I got other ways to turn that on. I'm doing it. How's that? Alright, so I need to play my shield right before this resolves. So I'm gonna keep an eye on that. That'll take it down to one, and then on my next turn I'll play Shield Boy. I'll get another shield that I'll have ready for this thing. Ouch, they did my trick. Alright, so I don't want to take all that damage, so we're going to get this guy going with the shield. And then this is going to deal me three. But I'm not going to take it. They're on one, and I finish them off. Alright, easy superstar. Honestly, I had like way tougher matches, more confusing in that uh, round robin. Nothing exciting or new here. 15 credits, though. Attention, card game... No, wait. We know we met the navigator. We met her. Attention, card game enthusiast. Cricket just moved from B tier to A tier. That is all. Heck yeah. Oh, I got two more stars. Do I got to beat the captain? Is the great reward just like trying to... Like, you get to play against the captain. Ooh, that's the fancy, fancy uh, final reward. I'm impressed. Only the undefeated has ever beaten me in a ranked match. Of course, that's mainly because I rarely play. At any rate, I'd like to continue watching the stars now. The end of the green tube should be coming into view any second now. I may as well stay and watch as well. Could you breathe a little quieter? Thank you. Oh god, I'm thinking about it now. Oh, it's the hype snake! Awesome! There it is, the end of the tube. But what's the green thing in the distance? The apathetic frog. Things have gotten weird. That is the face sphere. Whoa, how long has that- how long has she been standing there? The time is here. We are the first to observe it. It is no longer a theory. The- the face sphere is- Like, it's right there, you guys! I can't believe it! It's really real! Like, wow, wowie, wow, wow, wow! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! What is with this girl? Please stare here. Uh-oh, this can't be good. Attention all passengers, the green tube is about to collide with the face sphere. We must perform an emergency super space jump. Everyone hold on to something. Things have gotten strange. God, I just love their sense of humor though. Like all these signs telling you to look at this thing. It's just real funny. Attention all passengers, we apologize for the sudden jolt, but it was necessary to avoid the cosmic contradiction that just took place. We are currently on the opposite end of the galaxy. As for what happened when the tube and the sphere collided, well, they say that ignorance is bliss. Please continue, <laughs> Please continue to enjoy the cruise and have a nice space night. Fascinating. Isn't space such a beautiful place? Eee! I, I, yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's what I did for that. Hmm, you should probably carry her back to the medical wing. Me, I suppose I'll be heading down to the Star Wharf. Yee! 
Yep, we're gonna keep making that noise. Oh god, the peaking, the, the light for the peaks are... It's real. It's happening. This is gonna be a garbage recording. Just turn that down a notch. <laughs> I'll just put her down over here. Attention card game enthusiasts, the captain has just informed me that a surprise card game tournament will be held in the surprise tournament stadium. That's a nice name. The minimum required rank is A tier. Please go to the surprise tournament stadium if you would like to participate. That is all. Free sample medicine. Oh, I got a pack of card sleeves. Sorry, I don't think that's supposed to happen. Someone must have tampered with the free health potion samples. Why is everyone looking at me? I didn't do anything. Oh, those are cute. They're not what I want, though. I want me some fish bun sleeves. That's a beholder. Or a spectator. It only has four tentacles. It's a spectator. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I guess we move on to the surprise tournament stadium or we buy some packs. That's not where you buy packs at. That's the garden. Thanks for coming. I really need your help. Wait, what? Not a problem, young one. Do you have your climbing act or your chain axe ready? Yeah, I just finished it. So just jump out the airlock and fling it at the ship's hull to get a good swing going. Oh wait, no, no, no. she's asking a question. So I just jump out the the airlock and fling it at the ship's hull to get a good swing going? It's not as simple as that. In order to achieve the perfect swing, you need to aim the furthest point possible for your chain axe to hit, and without falling into space in the process. Good. I like the excitement. You'll get the hang of it after a few laps around the uh, around the ship. You are a chain axe, it's quite relaxing once you master it. Hey, just remember to wear a spacesuit, I forget sometimes. Hold it right there, what are you hoodlums planning? Oh, just some extra vehicular chain axing. That's right, he's, here's my license. Oh yes, this is indeed a real not forged chain axe license with your picture and name on it. My apologies, go ahead please. Thanks, and thanks for the axe tips, Gramps. Not a problem, have fun out there. Am I gonna be able to see her chain axing? The frick is this fish thing? Did I not get these coins before, or do they reset? <gasps> I was yawn. Uh. She drafts again. The mind parasite doesn't do anything. I came here accidentally. That's right. Gosh, see how bad my memory is. Like, can't even remember that. Alrighty. Welcome. Here are the boosters I'm selling. Fancy. Uh, when you play a ward card, deal with damage. Resolve dealing. Da this is this is a decent card. Give me another pack. Oogler. Oh, they have their own name for him. He's an Oogler. Wonder what game he's from. It'll do. Interesting. And I guess I never ran into them. Somehow. That's weird. Thanks for buying. Ooh, placement. Move this card to a random space and activate it. Resolve deal one damage. Resolve deal three. When you play a Jenny card, take one. Uh, no thanks. Wait, who the heck are you? You're new. Suspicious person. Hey there, how about some extra dimensional card sleeves? I thought a commoner like you would recognize me, but I'm actually an emperor from another dimension. My uh, people overthrew me for some reason. So yeah, here I am trying to get better at the card game so I can defeat the Dread Dark Lord Master. S Wait, the Dread Dark Lord Master Skeleton who led the revolution and stole my throne. I'm looking for some real powerful opponents here, you dig? I'll even give you a unique set of card sleeves from uh, my extra dimensional empire if you win, yeah? What? I want them! Want to give this a try? It won't be easy and you'll win a set of card sleeves, deal? Yes? <laughs> Just sign right here and then let the battle begin. Oh god, is there like... Is there consequences for losing? Turn a boy versus suspicious person. Oh, those card sleeves are lit. Ha. Ha. I get it. It's a joke. Duck Lord. I used to play Duck Lord. Duck Lord was a, uh, was a solid card. I don't really have much combo potential going here. I guess we'll uh, start here. Leave ourselves open to some stuff.
I mean, I am pinched now, so... Not sure what I'm gonna do. Guess we start a new chain. And wait to get that corner. Oh, that corner's not open now, though. Wait a second. Oh, I can't do it. Gosh dang. What am I doing here? What am I what am I doing here? This. I got so many half combos going. This. Deal four damage when active and you play a common card ticket. Wow, that's interesting. At least I won't take the two. Neat. Oh, and this turned on now. So I'll deal four. These are some uh these are some beefy cards I gotta watch out for here. I guess we'll we'll just advance them just to turn these on. It's not great to take that, you know, naked like I did, but... I have so many on cards now that I can really start cranking stuff up. This still isn't on, though, down here. Oh cool, we won. Apparently. We'll start with that, turn the bottom corner, huh? I just we'll just build regular chains until we get something going, I guess. Ah, you jerk. Oh, here's a little combo. Oh my god, I hate you. I have a rainbow ring. Suck it, ice ring. I mean, these are already on, so... Although, like, there's no need for me to help them. Because placing this down gives them a bunch of arrows they can use, so... Now I'm going to stick this here. Because this will be tying that up, and this will be tying that up for a while. They'll take another damage off of me drawing it. Yeah, I can like single-handedly turn that off then. Good. And then they just need to take one more damage for me to seriously tick some stuff here. Um, so we'll just we'll just play this. And then next turn I win unless they deal me heavy damage that I'm not seeing. Yeah, no. I uh, I win this game. I win this match. Give me the, give me some fish bone card sleeves, please. Oh, it's just the fire ones. Dang it, I guess my deck wasn't that good after all. So, uh, there's no way I can go back to my home dimension now. If I don't even- if I don't even have the best deck on this ship, how am I supposed to defeat the Dark Dreadlord Master Skeleton? Wait a minute, you've got a science lab here. I bet it's super primitive, but even you guys should be able to discover some new booster packs from time to time. I'll just wait around till that happens, okay? It's not like I've got anything better to do in this dump. I mean, this wonderful space station, starship, whatever. Buddy, a new booster was discovered, so I tried building the best deck possible with it. I need practice here. How about another set of sleeves if you can beat it? Wait, a new booster pack? He lied to me. He lied to me. He lied to me. Uh, you know what? Let's let's try it again. Maybe that's some fishbone card sleeves I'm looking for. You know the drill. Beat me win penny set of card sleeves. Let's take a peek. Let's take a little. Pikaroonie, fish boy, turnip boy, rather, versus... <laughs> Screw it, that, that... Oh, wait, what are the... Oh, it's Card City Knights 2 sleeves. Those are actually super rad. Those are actually really dope. Hmm. 
doesn't really help. Screw it. Oh wait, deal two piercing damage. Ugh. They might be a little tougher this time, and maybe I can't just say screw it, but I'm gonna say screw it, and we're gonna give it a go. Silence creator card, huh? Cage a common card. Resolve deal of damage. Hmm. I'm losing. Things are bad. I, I saved myself that two damage. So that takes down. That gives me another fire sword plant in here. Is that really what I want to do, though? Oh god, that's gonna do me two. I gotta, I gotta do something. What are things looking like here? That's going to resolve. Deal them one. I don't think I have this one. Let's try to block their chains, though, at least. Okay, so as long as I don't place one deal damage, then this kills them. Whew! Oh, that was close. Okay. Oh, we got we got just a classic little combo meal here. Wow, we really we really just do have classic combo builder. Why would you do that? I don't understand. I guess we just keep replacing things, huh? Just ch keep chaining along. Just can keep ticking down the damage stacks. Alright, I got my little, nice little combo coming soon. I mean, these are already turned on, so I guess I just do them. Things aren't looking too good for me right now. You know, things things aren't great. Ooh. Oh boy. Wait, these are these are on the verge of ticking down though. Oh, oh, the lucky potato. The double potato! <laughs> we got there. We got there off the back of the double potato. Oh my god, what luck. You know what that was? That was a... Uh, there's an insult in Magic the Gathering that people call each other luck sacks, but uh, that was a luck sack of potatoes. Haha, -ha, good joke. Shoot, this deck's not good enough either, huh? Man, there's no way I'm defeating the Dread Dark Lord Master 
Dread Dark Master Lord Skeleton, then at this rate, I'll just hang around until your Wimpy Science Lab discovers another booster pack. In the meantime, I'm just glad we're getting along so well, aren't we? Are, aren't we? Yeah, you're cool. Wowie, that isn't, that isn't that a relief? I mean, never mind, let's just focus on me kicking back and spending some quality time in this cozy little mall. Later. Yeah, later. And you know what, YouTube? Later to you two. The band. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye. Okay, testing. One, two, three, four. This is a test. This is a test. I hope this isn't garbage. I really should, uh... I really should just go ahead and edit. I just hit seven before doing this. Like, I should just jump into eight. Oh, well. I hope this, I hope this turns out okay.